backfield eye formation on first and 10 at the 25 yard line. And we see Hogan on first down, and Joel, that's what he brings. Six yards on first down, second down, four. Shotgun Hogan. Backs are split. Around the edge, Taylor makes a cut back. He's close to the first down, second, third effort, and he pushes the... Three wide receivers set, top of your screen, empty backfield. Is Hogan wants to throw for the first time, and he does underneath. That ball was caught and came out. Zach Ertz over for Oregon State. Just a simple crossing pattern over the middle. And Ertz, when he got hit, that ball was just way too loose. That was Fenty Tamoy Payout, the middle linebacker, number 41, who knocks it out. Oregon State recovers, and their offense now in business on the plus. First and 10, seven yard line for Stanford. Second goal line early for Hogan and Company. Rolls out of the backfield floor for Lolo. Bootleg, getting Kevin Hogan outside of the pocket is exactly what they wanted to do early in this game. Utilize the athleticism of the young quarterback. Misses the tackle and allows the first down. And a pick up of 13 yards. They go back to the ground, Ooh. dancing in the middle of the field. Not much for Taylor. Now look at the push. A flag on the far side. Downs 31 yard line. Hogan on a rollout, stumbles, gathers his feet, has room. And then slingshots it out of bounds. You never know. Second down, 10. Play clock to five. Hogan, straight back drop throw. Threads the needle on the hands of Taylor. And he With the pressures of a big game. Watch the pocket. Hogan steps right up. Steps confidently into the throw. Not too much pressure. Getting the ball out on time, which is always... Take the range of Stanford. Rolls to his left. Fires. Turn. And a catch complete, 40th reception. He made up for it on this one, again moving the pocket. This time, very difficult, moving to your left and throwing down the field, and an accurate pass delivered by Hogan. Ertz laying out for this ball, bringing it in and getting that right foot down. And a gain of 18 yards, they're at inside Oregon State territory, 45-yard line, stop and go is Taylor. Like a strong. This year for the Beavers. And a big challenge today. Seventh play of this drive coming up for Stanford. Play action. Quick throw near side. Kesley Young breaks a tackle inside the third. Front of that screen. Watch the athleticism here. This is David Yankee, number 54, a junior. Gets out and clears the path for that screen pass to get down to the 26 yard line. Down the field. Always got to do your job. There's the lane cleared out. Out in front of that as well. We got a little wildcat going on now as they spread out Hogan. Anthony Wolf athleticism getting outside. Yeah, new chapters in the offensive playbook for Pep Hamilton. Hogan and alongside is Taylor. Steps in the pocket, has time. Watch out, can run. Breaks a tackle 20. 15 and out of bounds. Saves his body. DC suburbs and Joel this is what you're talking about he's in the pocket he doesn't like it so he can take off just how different Joel early does this Stanford offense look with him taking the snap 10th play of this drive James at the 13 yard line they pitch it outside Taylor hits the edge 10 cuts five stumbles inside the one yard line it's time they touch the football Option, keeper, close. Up the backfield. Hogan lost the handle, jumped on it. Different for a quarterback to take a snap on the goal line. It's different on a third and short or a fourth down situation in a short yard. You have to ride that center into his. Hewitt, number 85, saved that football, got down on it. Third down and goal. Already seven first downs for Stanford looking for more. They find the right side. Country in the first quarter. This team gets out to great starts. So far, 120 yards of total offense in this opening quarter. Hogan on a roll. He'll throw flat, top, Hewitt, the fullback. Watch out, breaks a tackle. 
and it is pushed out. And a good receiver. That's his sixth reception and takes it for 24 yards. They call that a slide route from the fullback. He starts out on the right side and then he slides back behind them. He's very good as a fullback in the run game blocking. At midfield, play action. Going for the home run, center of the field, incomplete. Just over three minutes to play, first quarter. Hogan wants another big throw over the top, and again, incomplete. This time, Ertz, the end of 10. Hogan sets, fires, and traffic. Oh, the pads are popping Terrell. Junior from Corona, California, listen to this. Just dropped back into that route from his corner position, and that's where Drew Terrell was. How about that effort from Terrell to hold on to that football with the eclipse? Second down three. 163 total yards here early. Wilkerson trying to work his way to the edge, hits the 30, stiff arms, and is chased out of bounds. Back and Joel Klett, I know, appreciates the talents of his wide receiver on that play. Get that foot down and catch the ball. I'm coming back to you. Hogan sets up a screen. It's Hewitt. Again, hard hit. Far for Stanford in this first quarter. And the ninth play of this drive. Here's the ability of Kevin Hogan. Actually a pseudo semifinal game in the division with both teams having to play Oregon later. On a boot, Hogan wide open throws on the hands of Hewitt. Breaks a tackle and bangs his way in. How about the flow of the defense? Watch Jordan Poyer. He goes with the tight end. The linebackers all crash with the run fake. And Hewitt is left wide open on another. And they find the end zone. Stanford goes back to work. Stephon Taylor in the eye formation. Hogan play action rolls. Sidesteps some trouble, but I'll tell you what, some good play drives from Stanford. Long snap count under center. Second down, 13 for Hogan. He'll pitch it out. Taylor on his hands, hit the edge, turns the corner, and then his push. Warrior, one of the best in all of the country. Third down and three. Cardinal three for three on third down conversions so far in this first half. Low snap. Hogan looks one way, throws the other. In traffic. That was a tough one-handed grab. There's over two minutes of play in this first half. Stanford owned the first quarter. Hogan State answers. Now they go to Stephon Taylor, who can turn a game around in a hurry. Clock stopping on first downs and obviously getting out of bounds. On a hurry up, Hogan. Out of the pocket, runs, throws a stiff arm, and then smart. Just a remarkable feat for Stephon Taylor. He averages 22 carries a game. He's very durable. He'll get the call again, weaves his way past midfield. The two-minute situation for the first time, and this is it for him. Hogan, three-step drop, slings it wide open, far side. Jamal Rashard Patterson. Shirt freshman under center has that run ability. They get the five yards back for 165. Hogan ball batted down and picked off. Ryan Murphy. Fafita is the guy who plays it perfectly and is right in the face of Kevin Hogan. I thought he should have just kept running and tried to out flank Fafita, but as he tips the ball, that's when Ryan Murphy, number 25, turns into an athlete. They trail by a count of 2014. Little shovel pass. Not much. There's no doubt about that. Nick Saban, his boys won't go down without a fight. Hogan, underneath. 
This will be third down and 10. Hogan from the shotgun. Watch out. Pressure from the edge. Anthony Special he thought was brewing with his ball club. Stanford going back to work and it looks like their defense finally settled down after getting shredded by Oregon and giving up an early touchdown there as you said. Hogan stands in the pocket, tosses it out to Ertz. Hogan barks out the calls. Now he rolls from the pocket, slings it near side, right on the hands of Ertz by Oregon State and nearly through the third quarter. Taylor shuffles his feet. Oregon State follows. Position, the right time. 14 carries, 83 yards. He had 78 of those in the first half. And traffic, oh, nearly intercepted. 82nd in the country. Play clock, hit six. Takes a snap with three seconds to spare. Flushed from the pocket, touch and goes. Hogan, he had seven yards. Last week he had seven in the win against Colorado for 48. Back to the ground, Stephon Taylor weaves his way to the 40. Eighth play of this drive. Second down six, and the pocket Hogan flushed. Oh, flings it, Taylor, wide open, hits the edge, breaks it, 20, 15, Stephon, 10, 5, touchdown! Back to work goes Kevin Hogan. Hogan, there's it again, the escapability. Stanford 5 of 7 on third down conversions. They need three yards to move the chains. Tough throw near side on the money at the Taylor alongside Hogan. Play clock to one. Get the snap away. Hogan sets his feet. Ball deflected. Still caught. Hurts. And his job. 19th consecutive start. He's probably got the best speed of the linebacking core for Oregon State. I'm surprised there's not a flag as there was a couple of. That's only losing one ball game. That's a terrific story. Bill O'Brien done that heck of a job. Third down and nine. Long ball up top. Man coverage. Finally four. And intercepted back down to the 30. And now Hogan back to work in round. Rashad Patterson. Oregon State's defense stayed in. A loss of seven. And second down and 17. Under eight minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Back to the ground. Big hole. Taylor weaves his way. Past the 25 game, 16 carries for 99. Little draw play. First down. Tate. Trying to bait the official for a holding call. He comes through, and right there, that's the tackle that was missed. Stephon Taylor moved to his right. In Stanford football history. On a boot goes Hogan. Throws. Pop. Ryan Hewitt. Quarterback Cody Pass giving him this opportunity. Power eye, second down and two. It's Taylor again. Slips through past the five. David Hawk team, their offensive line very tough. Stephon Taylor in the backfield. Stands up in that eye, wants the ball. Here's the ball. And he is ridden in goal. Hogan barks the calls, looks at the end zone. Second down at five. Taylor. Seven of ten on third down conversions. They need three yards to keep this drive alive. Instead, they boot it out to home.